not. Okay. Can you stop jumping for like two seconds? All right, cool, thanks. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't roll, I didn't stagger, I didn't do anything. I just died like an idiot. All right, let's actually wreck Sif this time instead of getting freaking womboed like a schmuck. Wow, okay. Note to self, uh, does not stagger. Need to uh, dodge and heal. Half, almost half health though. Oh, God, what an idiot. Oh yeah, oh, okay, well, heal please. Quickly, you schmuck. All right, much, oh, what the fuck was that? No, 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 no. Oh, that stupid magic boss. You mother... All right, let's do this. Don't. Don't. I... Okay. All right, let's go kill Sif, and then we'll do four kings. And then uh, we'll run to um, Lost Isleth, or we'll lost. Uh, we'll go open that shortcut anyway, and then we'll do. We'll go back and grab Dark Moon Blade, and then we'll finish the game. So this fight shouldn't be that bad. It really just depends. It can be bad, or I can do enough damage to not make the fight last very long. It's kind of my goal here. It's just to do damage and get out of here. Because he has some attacks that can really uh, mess me up if I don't dodge correctly. So I've got to be real careful. Alright. Let's go. Alright, let's just go ahead and top off. Hey, you mind getting down from your little fucking hillside there? Mr. Obi-Wan Kenobi High Ground? Alright then, game! Do you effing mind? That's how it should have gone the first, like, six times. Thanks. Ugh. Alright. And we go to Firelink, and uh, we do four kings. All right, this ought to be interesting. We're going to use the same tactic we did last time to skip a little piece and uh, see if we can do this the cool guy way. Let's try it. I don't know how well this is going to work, but we're going to try it. I think plus seven is the max on your Estus Flask as well. I've actually got a, a soul I can offer to her and find out, but I think it is. If I'm not mistaken. All right, we got to get past the ghosts. <sighs> Whee! Nice. All right. This shouldn't be that bad. I'm just going to run past everything that I can, really. Oh, hello. Yes, text message. I will read you in momentarily. Alright. Let's get this bread. By bread, I mean let's get this water drained out of this freaking... Hashtag drain the swamp. Jokes. Anyway. Let's go. Alright. Let's do this. See if I can just ignore these ghosts. This is practice for next run anyway. My pacifist run. Let's see how this goes. Pardon. Pardon. See ya. Wouldn't wanna be ya. 
that works. It's not bad at all. Let's grab this just to have it. Ho! Oh, hello. Let's get right about here where they won't follow me. Let's go ahead and grab our... Let's just swap this. There we go. Sir, pardon me. There we go. The headshot does uh, way more health. There we go. Hey, controller. I'll stop screwing my thumbstick. Nice. Key the seal. Got it. All right. All right, we should be able to make this jump. Okay, whoo! I didn't think I made it, but I did. Ow! <laughs> Cheese and rice, dude. Leave me alone. I don't want it. All right. All right. So now, um, let's see. There's a better way to get down here. I guess I should go back, really. Well, that's a terrible idea, but I think I'm going to try it. Wait, isn't the boss fight, like, right here? Oh my god, it is. Oh my god, it is. Oh my god, it is. <laughs> oh! Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. All these speedrunning tactics that I've never really used. And get down here so I'm away from all the freaking ghosts and stuff. Alright. I can't use... I gotta wait out freaking, uh... Transient curse so I can use power within. Gotta make sure I... Oh, that's right. I gotta change gear anyway. Can you stop, game? Alright, good. I can wear havels and I can wear my... My black boots. Black leggings. Alright, and as soon as, uh, freaking... Transient Curse wears off. Alright boys, let's do this. Alright. Uh, a bit of a better start this time, believe it or not. Let's get our... I don't think I have any souls here. Let's just retrieve it, just for giggles. See if we can figure out where the next guy's going to spawn at. Oh, 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 there he is. And... Not bad. Not bad at all. Much, much better. Oh, almost two kings on new game plus two? Jeez, we're doing some good damage. Come on. One more. One more. One more. Goodbye! Goodbye! Whew! So effing easy! And there's Koth, our buddy! Oh, God. What do we even level up now? 
Greetings, undead warrior. I am the primordial serpent, Darkstalker Kaf. I can guide thee and illuminate the truth. The truth I shall share without sentiment. After the advent of fire, the ancient lords found the three souls, but your progenitor found a fourth unique soul, the Dark Soul. Your ancestor claimed the Dark Soul and waited for fire to subside, and soon the flames did fade and only dark remained. Thus began the Age of Men, the Age of Dark. However, Lord Gwyn trembled at the dark, clinging to his age of fire and in dire fear of humans and the Dark Lord who would one day be born amongst them. Lord Gwyn resisted the course of nature by sacrificing himself to link the fire and commanding his children to shepherd the humans. Gwyn has blurred your past to prevent the birth of the Dark Lord. I am the primordial serpent. I seek to right the wrongs of the past, to discover our true lord. But the other serpent, Framped, lost his sense and befriended Lord Gwyn. Undead warrior, we stand at a crossroads. Only I know the truth about your fate. You must destroy the fading Lord Gwyn who has coddled fire and resisted nature and become the fourth lord so that you may usher in an age of dark. Very well. I shall now guide you to Gwyn's prison. Be still and trust thine flesh to me. Okie dokie. So, there's two ways to get to the uh, Lord Vessel location. It's either by Koth or by Frampt. Um, both are, like, telling you that theirs is the correct version of events. One of them blatantly tells you that the other one is lying, so it's, it's hard to say who's actually telling the truth, because in the DLC, it's very explicitly mentioned that the Abyss was brought forth because they listened to the Serpent, so... It's like, you know, did Koth doom them? Because that wasn't good either. So. Alright, we place the Lord Vessel. Sweet. Uh, let's go ahead and put this back on. Alright, so now we really only have... We only have three more Lord Souls to get. But in order to get them, we still have to fight... Two more bosses other than them. And that's really it. So there's only five bosses left. So, heck yeah. Did they not give me that many soldiers? I already, I just already leveled up. Okay. I was like, oh wow, I'm not, I don't have that money, but okay. Um, okay. Let's put the fire link. We need to do Quailag and Ceaseless and open the shortcut to Lost Isolith so that way I can go get my Dark Moon Blade. We could also offer... No, I don't have enough humanity. We could have also offered 30 humanity to Koth and gotten the uh, Dark Wraith set. I don't have enough humanity for that, though. Do I to offer both? So I got 60, so I need... Th oh, wow, actually, I do have enough for both. Why don't we just do it? Okay, let's go back to the Abyss real quick, and let's do Dark Wraith and get all the stuff for it. I'll get the full set. Cool, let's do it. Oh, right, I have to actually use them first. Alright, so let's use... 30. Wow, okay, thanks game. What 
Okay, now I want to offer humanity. Which should get me all the armor and I believe the blade as well, the dark blade or whatever. Or, or dark sword, yeah, I got the full dark set. Nice. Okay, whatever. Alright, so that's that. Now we have the dark set. So now let's go back to Firelink and we'll go to, uh... Light Town. And do Quaylag. We'll also grab the uh, Dragon Scale while we're there. And upgrade our fist. But I want to show you though, in case you haven't ever seen it before, the uh, dark set, because it's pretty cool. Go ahead and put our Havel's Ring back on. But yeah, this is the dark set. So it's pretty legit. You'd actually have... So I'd actually have the... Dark Hand and the Dark Blade... Dark Sword. So this is that. This is literally a dark... Uh, nice. What's what's this sword? I don't remember. Is it... Uh, I'm sure it's Strength, isn't it? It's C and C. What does it upgrade to? So it's kind of mediocre, because it's C in both. So, like, it's not, doesn't do any good scaling, honestly. Yeah, only 143. It's pretty lame. So, screw that. Back to our falchion. And, uh, go ahead and... Well, I could always do this. This is a new look. Spooky. But, we're not. We're going to go back to my Mask of the Sealer. We're going to go to the... Uh, Grass Crest. Okay. That should be it. So let's... Go to Blight Town. And, yeah. Blight Town. Blight Town. Do some uh, quay lag. Oh, I did not send the elevator back up. What a schmuck. Yeah, we'll do... How many... How long? We'll probably... We'll go ahead and do quay lag... Open the do ceaseless. Open the shortcut, and then we will uh, probably cut. Well, we may go real quick. Grab Darkman Blade, and then we'll cut there, and we'll do uh, more next time. Um, I'm trying to think, cause like then we just got Duke's archives, which I'll do the Duke skip for. We've got uh, Nito, which I just have to run past all the junk and get to, which the Nito will be kind of rough. Uh, which I do have my, um, Devout Falchion. So that'll be Divine Falchion. There we go. I was like, it's not Devout. Devout's like a class. <laughs> uh, okay. And then, of course, we have, uh, Better Chaos. Which, Better Chaos... I guess I can go ahead and do it, like, while we're here-ish, but, uh... Man, does it suck. I hate Better Chaos. There's a way to, like, roll down this to, like, land at all the right spots and, and, like, know what you're fucking doing, but I don't know it, so. It'd be something like this. Again, I'm not all that great at it. I was doing a little bit safely there. Because, uh, it's scary. But alright. Let's see, we'll go grab this, uh, bonfire. We'll grab the dragon scale. Maybe we'll pop a humanity and kill, uh, what's her face? Manager Mildred? Just for giggles. And then, uh, we'll do the fight. Is there really any point to do Mildred other than just. I haven't done any Kirk either. I won't be able to get Kirk this time. I already have it set, so it doesn't really matter. There's no reason to get the souls either, really. I mean, she may drop like 30k or something, but again, it doesn't matter. Let's go and upgrade the fist, though. 
So the Dragon Bone Fist is one of the unique weapons because it can actually, it's a boss weapon that can actually be buffed. So you can do an Iron Fist type thing where you've got like a sparkly glowy fist. Uh, yeah, Dragon Bone Fist. Nice. So now I need way more Dragon Scales, which I won't be able to get till successful playthroughs. So once we get it to plus five, we'll actually do a full playthrough using it, but not until then, because no. But anyway, let's continue right along. Again, do we want to mess with Mildred? I guess we can. Just to, uh, just to do it. Let's do it. Let's do it just to mess with Mildred. And then we'll go fight Quaylag. Because we don't actually summon Mildred in for Quaylag. Should we? Nah, let's not. That's no, no reason to do that. I should be able to walk, like, right here. I see the flame popping up, so she'll spawn in and invade us. Now we wait. Yep. Should we do a uh, Sunlight Blade? I think we should, just for giggles. Bye! And your little freaking mosquito friend, too. That was only 8k souls? Lame. Okay, well. Good to know. Get that over with. Let's go kill uh, Quaylag. Bye. I love Sunlight Blade so much. Like, at this point, I just can't imagine doing a build without Sunlight Blade, really. Oh, let's... Let's, uh... Do that. All right. Let's see how quickly we can take this lady out. Again, new game plus two. Um, I need to be careful and not get murdered by lava because she's actually cheesed me a few times now. You know what? Why don't we just grab Mildred? Just for have we used her yet at all in a fight? I don't know that we have. Let's just go ahead and grab her, just for giggles. I don't even know if she spawned in, because I think I may have canceled it before she even came in. Good damage, though. See you later, Mildred. Love it. You love to see it. You love to see it. Bells of Awakening who? I guess we can ring it just to do it, but we don't need it. Don't even need to. Who cares? Yep. I guess free homeward button though. All right, let's go grab this bonfire, and we'll get the shortcut open by doing this. Um, where am I looking at? Here we go. Oh, but you don't have any eggs. Yes, I'm a new servant. Oh, but you have no eggs. Blah blah blah. All right, so we need to pop. We already have two, so we need what twenty eight. All right, let's enter Covenant. Uh-huh. And let's offer humanity. Nice, okay. Hey, do you mind? Can I use the... Okay, thank you. Alright, let's go do Ceaseless now. So there's a way to skip Ceaseless. You have to roll across the lava 
And there's little safe spots. Where you can actually stop and heal up and get across. I don't think there's any way I can make it with only having uh, 10 health. I just don't think there's any way. So... Let me just double check that. It's... Alright, it's doable. But I'm not going to because... This is my bonfire I'm going to use since I'm not doing uh, Fire Sage or Centipede. So if I have to run back whenever I inevitably die to Bed of Chaos, my run back is from this bonfire I just left because I won't have the elevator above Fire Sage. So I would have to do the ceaseless skip every single time I ran back if I do it. And that's not worth it. <laughs> so I might try it in a future playthrough. Maybe next run. Whenever I do pacifist run, I might try it. Um, or the playthrough after so I don't know, something. But we're definitely not doing it now. We're going to do it on one where I do kill Fire Sage and I do kill Centipede. Because I need those bonfires. Because if I... Skipping Centipede without the Orange Shard Ring means there's no bonfire between Demon Ruins and... Um, and Bed of Chaos. So I would have to I would have to do Bed of Chaos correctly the first time, or else I reset all the way back and have to do it again. And that's not not worth it, to be honest. So Alright, let's not die. Close. He tried to murder me. He tried. But I have a lot of endurance. Like, a lot. I'll tell you, though, if you fail this cheese, and he, you actually have to fight him legit, this is a very difficult fight. Like, very difficult. Come here, buddy. Alright. Not bad, not bad at all. Alright, nice. Alright, so with that... Oh, you know what? I was wrong. There's actually, there is the bonfire there where the little worm comes out of the wall. But you can't warp to it, so I still would have been, I would have had to do it twice. Regardless. So, still not worth it. But like I said, we'll do it one time in the future. Whenever I actually plan on, on doing the full thing. Because once I, once you get the elevator from Daughter of Chaos, like, it doesn't matter. I just won't unlock it this time, so I don't want to do with that. So anyway. Also, the uh, Chaos Embers out there across the lava. Out there. There's some items and things which you have to fight like six Tarth Demons for. Which I'm not about that, so. But essentially you have to like roll along these little high points here to survive the lava. And it's like pixel perfect basically, so I would have to have tried several times, I'm sure, just to even get it. But anyway. Hey, how about you not do what you're thinking of doing? Thanks. Like, once I get the stagger going, we're good, but just, jeez, his damage. It won't be long, like, maybe next new game, the new game plus three, where I'll just be, like, one shot by everything. It's coming. The day is coming soon. For sure. Alright, let's get this, uh... Might use a bow for this, actually. What we might do here is use the bow for this bonfire. Oh, Kirk is still a thing. Okay, Kirk. Kirk, okay. Is he gonna jump down here and fight me? Or, like, what's his deal? I wonder.
All right, controller, calm down. I know where he spawns, but like, is he gonna run all the way around and down to come fight me? Oh, he is. Okay, buddy. Buddy, okay. Wow. Bye. Wow, he drops like 30k souls. Wow. Got him. Alright, nice. Let's go open that shortcut. And, uh... And we'll be done for right now with this area. I'm going to go and open that shortcut. I'm kind of hoping he'd fall off the ledge whenever he did that, but I don't think he did. I didn't see any souls pop. Like I said, I could absolutely go right now and do Bed of Chaos. But I really don't want to. I mean, and we can. Let's... <sighs> Let's try it once. If, if I get murdered and have to run all the way back, maybe we'll do something else. Let's try it. Once. While we're here. Let's just... Let's just try it. Get back here. Where's the one that's the... Where's the red eye one? Is that the one I was chasing was the red eye one? I guess it was. What a little punk. Yeah, which one of you guys dropped the thing? Yep, see? Okay, you dropped it. Cool. Good to know. Alright. Moving right along. <laughs> Let's... If I get fucking... Uh, Bed of Chaos first try, this will literally be my best run ever. Because I... Essentially always die to Bed of Chaos. Um, there is a cheese you can do that involves a bow and... Okay. We won't do it this time. Let's go <laughs> get um, Dark Moon Blade. Stop. Halt. halt. Yep. This is the tomb of the great Lord Gwyn. Tarnished, uh -huh. it shall not, if thou hear the... Yep, yep, okay. Let's kneel and join up. Disciple of the dark sun. Uh -huh. Thou hast journeyed far. Hear my voice. Uh -huh. If thou shalt swear by a shadow... Yep, a I shall. Yes. <laughs> Yes. Very well hunted. Okay. Yes. All right. So now, if we go to Toon Magic, let's see. Alright, so let's... Just, just to be... Alright, so if we do... Power then, and then we do Darkman Blade. Nice, and then we do both of our... Well, I guess we only need one, right? And then we'll do uh, Homeward. Nice! And we'll swap this Talisman for the Dark Moon Talisman. Nice. So now we have Dark Moon Blade, which looks like this. Oh, so good. Love it. 
792, baby. 792. Alright. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, feel free to leave a like. Comment down below what your favorite part was. And of course, if you want to see more, please subscribe. I'm Alec, and I'll see you next time. Hmm.